ఐ బి సెయింగ్ అబౌట్ ద స్టోరీ మిస్టర్ ఫ్రాగ్ అండ్ ది ఆక్స్ సో వన్స్ పాయింట్ సో వన్స్ పాయింట్ టైమ్ వన్స్ పాయింట్ టైమ్ దే విజ్ ఎ గ్రూప్ ఆఫ్ ఫ్రాగ్స్ విచ్ విచ్ వాస్ లివింగ్ నియర్ ఎ పాండ్ అండ్ ఇన్ దిస్ గ్రూప్ ఆఫ్ ఫ్రాగ్స్ ఈచ్ అండ్ ఎవరీ ఫ్రాగ్ హ్యాడ్ ఇట్స్ యూనిక్ టాలెంట్ వన్ కుట్రన్ వన్ కుట్రన్ ఎక్స్ట్రీమ్లీ ఫాస్ట్ అండ్ ది అదర్ ఫ్రాగ్ ఇట్ కుడ్ జంప్ ది హైయెస్ట్ పీక్ ఇన్ ద ఇన్ ద పాండ్ అండ్ అండ్ సమ్ ఆఫ్ ద ఫ్రాగ్స్ హ్యాడ్ దర్ ఓన్ యూనిక్ టాలెంట్స్ బట్ దెర్ వాజ్ వన్ ఫ్రాగ్ విచ్ థాట్ దట్ ఇట్ ఇట్ షుడ్ బి కంట్రోలింగ్ ఆల్ ద ఫ్రాగ్స్ and it has it has the most uh, it has the most useful talent in all and that frog it was extremely big in size when compared to the other frogs uh, uh, and and his name was max max always thought that he was the um, he was the huge, he was the most huge living organism that ever existed on this planet they also thought that um, the pond in which they were living was the only pond in the entire planet and uh, and the thinking in this way because um, these are because um, their pond or their or their habitat is located deep inside the jungle so no one would ever come inside to visit it so th- so all of them continued continued to think uh, to think that um, we are only the inhabitants of this planet this is uh, this is our only pond and max is the biggest of all um and and uh, and max could not even agree if someone says that um, he, he, someone says that um, they they saw someone uh, even bigger as him even bigger as him um so uh, um so keeping this all so keeping all of this aside um one day one day uh, some frogs in which um, in, in which one of them was a child of max um they um uh, they sneaked they sneaked into the other side of their habitat and they found an, and they found another pond they were extremely um, they were extremely shocked to see and so to see a second pond as i said um because um because uh, as i said they thought they, they thought that there was only one pond in the entire planet so as they as they now saw the second pond they were they were very excited um and ran in, and, and ran in, and ran inside it and then they suddenly saw a huge animal it was not even in comparison to the size of max it was extremely huge and that was an ox um and when the ox came everyone was extremely frightened um thinking that um the mr ox will eat him but he said oh i don't eat any animals i just eat my i just eat my grass then all of them were extremely relieved um, and they and they quickly ran to max and said what happened max was not able to believe it he he was never he was never ready to accept that someone could be even bigger as him so he so he started to make himself even bigger by inflating air into his stomach at some point he re- he reached his maximum maximum efforts and he could not do any more but max to impress his friends and uh, children he um, he continued to he continued to um, to blow in even more air uh, and as expected uh, he exploded he he exploded because of the infl- inflation uh, and he, and he, he was not even seen in the jungle um, all the children cried and every, and uh, all the kids were extremely sad so the moral of, the moral is that every child is special in his own way and we should now and we should never compare a child to a, uh, to another thank you